And just as the Haymakers have done all season, they dominated again today. Kozad comes to Lincoln and gets that coveted state championship. They defeat Ashland Greenwood 47-21 to in a game that wasn't even that close. The Haymakers were able to establish the line of scrimmage early with Jake Paulson. He had a 66-yard touchdown run 55 seconds into the game, and it really set the tone for the rest of the day. Uh, the Haymakers were also able to get a big-time contribution from Colin Watovic. He had a pair of touchdowns, 71 yards rushing on the ground. Uh, Alex Baritza also had two, two touchdowns on the ground, and this, this was a, a blowout pretty much from the start. Uh, the Haymakers dominated the total yards in this one. Uh, they have 277 yards rushing to Ashland Greenwood's 41 yards rushing. And uh, really, this was behind an offensive line that has done exactly that all season. They dominated. They talked about uh, after the game about this was a business trip for them. This, this is the exact approach that they've always had. And today was no different. So uh, the Haymakers came exactly came came and did exactly what they they had hoped to do Brian Cargill is in his first year as the Cozad head coach and he still has not lost a game he is now 13 and 0 with that state championship the Haymakers first state championship in 22 years definitely going to be a, a a big building block going forward uh, he, he has definitely laid the foundation for that program. So the Haymakers are going to look to continue to do it again with uh, the likes of Connor Young and Colin Watovic returning next year. Well, a lot of satisfaction because in all three phases of the game, as any coach will tell you, if you can take care of business, it makes things a lot easier. It takes a field position, defense leading to offense, and that type of thing. Uh, everybody everybody had a part. Everybody on the team did what they were supposed to do and got the job done. And, you know, that's football. It's team sport, and they did a great job with it. Yeah, it's, it's a great feeling. We've worked so hard for it all year. I mean, the scoreboard may not show up, but this is not as easy as it looks. We worked all season long for it. We prepared all week, came out, and we were able to dominate up front. And that led to our success, both, both offensive and defensive. Yeah, I mean, you don't generally expect that, but uh, you know, I felt like if our kids executed, and the thing we talked about is just take care of business and doing what you're supposed to do. And the kids did that nice job, and uh, you know, wins a win, whether you win by one or a hundred, and I thought they did a great job.